Hello, I'm Andrew Lissim and welcome back to XCOM News We have an alien abduction in Canada, in Ottawa. Not here, in Canada. It's heavy, it's worth 100 quid, we're off. So for this, uh, I kind of decided after the last heavy abduction mission that we should probably put a little bit more uh, thought into what we take. So Van Dorn, who is a sergeant and needs, you know, experience, we kind of want more than a sergeant level. He's a very respectable sergeant. Um, 105 aim, with a scope, admittedly. But still, really respectable. His issue is 7 health. Uh, we haven't put any more health on him. I mean, 5 base health is great for a sniper, don't get me wrong. But I'm not putting extra, any extra health on him, which I probably should do. Like, I could chuck him in Carapace Army, he'd be basically indestructible. Yeah, let's do it. No, 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 no. Two move? Okay, not worth it. If, if it was, like, one move, yeah, okay. Uh, all objective rounds means you'll be doing a bit more damage. Snipers are definitely showing their age at the moment. Dagger, but Kellen definitely needs to go up a couple of levels. We have double chem, double alien grenade. Carbine 7 is there for heat. Craig Entwistle, our new Goliath, is going to be running up to people and basically standing in front of them, flaming them, taking a load of damage, and hopefully not dying. Cave Devil is commanding. The reason I put Cave Devil in is because I kind of wanted to put in uh, a decent medic. As red as blood... Ah, uh, Lance Corporal Scout needs to be getting a couple more levels. Dat Zimby, Corporal Assault needs to be getting a couple more levels. Alloy Rifle, absolute beast for weapon. And Tim Gibbs. The uh, reason I chucked Tim Gibbs on the end rather than, uh, say, one of our low ranked infantry that needs to be able to get a couple of levels is because I want more heat. I'm afraid of things. I'm afraid of mechs. I'm afraid of cyber discs. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And more heat, the better. So we're going in. We've got two pretty heavy heaters. I'm not going to be too afraid of anything, you know, mechanical. Apart from the usual, of course. And... Touching down. Okay. Drop site for this Heavy on this map. This map's fairly small. The aliens are continuing mm. to target civilians for abduction in several major cities across well, the world. Well, let's go to a petrol station. We have to get down we there can and pick up some, uh, some magazines. Maybe get some sweets if they've got a sweet section. Get some crisps for the ride home. Leave some money on the counter. You guys did remember to bring money in the pockets on your armor. You've got pockets on your armor, right? Hmm. We'll send them a check. I kind of imagine that I'm standing there in the middle where that camera is, basically giving them a pep talk. I don't know why the commander would come in the Sky Ranger. That's very dangerous. Something the Gengar's Khan was a fan of. Not coming with the troops, but actually, uh... Solid copy, big sky. Strike one is uh, cleared to engage. What do I mean? Genghis Khan was a fan of... managing his army rather than just being in the front and being like, Ah, war! Which is kind of why, um, he won a lot. And other things. Okay. So this corner's not great because we can advance either way and we could trigger on both sides, so we've got to be incredibly cautious. Uh, that's only half cover, so I'm going to trigger this way. Position confirmed. Eyes on Hello! Ah, uh, bollocks. Please tell me we can shoot the mech. Nope. Okay, right. Well, if we move up with our scout... Heading to that location. I can't believe the mech smashing windows. Everyone's into the window smashing now. And thankfully, he destroyed his own wall. That's actually really handy for us. And we still can't see him. God damn it. This is only half cover. How is it blocked? Oh, it's full cover. But it looks like sometimes this is half cover. I'm so confused. Anyway, we need to get into position. Now, I want to rock it here, but of course I can't this turn. Hmm, so many things I can't do this turn. Do we have... Nope. Okay, I'm gonna go to here. It might it might trigger though. I can't do it. I guess I'll go to here. Moving. Uh, I was gonna say a smoke grenade. That's what we're looking for. Oh good, Mel. Yeah, that's, that makes up for it. Right, chem grenades do affect mechanicals. Yes. They don't do it in terms of the minus one health, etc. But chem grenades mean that I didn't use a chem grenade, did I? 
Oh well, it was still a perfectly valid choice, but I would have preferred to have used the chem grenade. Okay, I guess we could run and gun, but it risks it risks triggering our pod. Hmm. Heading out. Forty-five. He needs to die in case he mechs, uh, does something to his mechy friend. I can use him as a half cover, actually. Yeah! I have you covered. Right, well that's nice. We can use him as full cover. I thought it was only half. <gasps> Mind blown. Also, heat. Nine damage. Okay, what else have we got? I'm probably going to need to duck. I don't really want to be standing in the open for this. Um, to that location. We're probably going to take a hit from the sectoid. I'm pretty much allowing that now. Ouch. Well deserved. Okay, what else have we got? Paramedic Cave Devil. Aye, aye, Commander. 44. Try it. Worth a try. We're hunkering. You're going to have to move. To full cover, which we don't have. Okay. 45. Please be a kill. Yes! Ah, oh, Van Dorn, you legend! That's gonna be an Overwatch. I don't know about you. I guess if we move you far enough back, hopefully he won't be able to shoot you. Just. Okay. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Move. No! I'm losing control of the situation! Dagobert Krakelin. He was only new! No, no, no! Please, no! He was brand new. God damn it. And Tim Gibbs has panicked. Tim is in charge of our. Oh dear. Him was our heater. Damn it, Dagobert Krakelin, why'd you have to die? It wasn't it wasn't a opportune time. It was a point blank almost. Full cover in the late, but Oh, did Peter Peter Van Dorn panicked? This is madness. Take that. Okay, meld. New priority. Solid copy. Hostile spotted. Zerka. Okay. Let's start moving up. Now, I guess if we move to here, Heading we can get some decent now. cover going. That's not a great chance to hit. That, however, is. Basically, this turn I've decided we're not shooting the Berserker. Okay, um, your target might be disabled. Heading to that location. You just stand on your corpse, your friend. You don't mind that, right? Can you one for all again, please? Oh, I can't do it. Now your turn's ended. Oh well. On the move. On the move. 
Dodge, dodge. Ooh. Okay. Mel's probably gone as well. Let's run his blood. Move up. Yeah, we're not taking any of these shots. Uh, tempting. Tempting as it is. There's a lot of floaters to kill. Um, I... Move to here. Don't trigger, don't trigger, don't trigger. Good. Okay. Now, what have we got left? Peter Van Dorn. Yeah, we're not doing that. Oh, <laughs> And that's the last pot, I suspect. With Seekers. Great. I really could use some grenades. Miss. Everyone missed. What? Oh, that completely makes up. Actually, seven damage isn't bad. But still, I am somewhat disappointed. Hi. That looks like a rocket launch to me. Okay. And I'm out in the open, technically. No! They'll be on line of sight. Okay. So that could be a rocket there. Deviation's a little bit on the high side. Well, I guess we take the shot with the shotgunner who's right next to him. Only six. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic. I said one thing. I don't want to risk another panic. Good amount of damage. The only issue is going to be if they come and uh, they flank, which is certainly a high possibility. Covering fire. Goddamn covering fire. At least you've got only one health. And we've got lightning reflexes. Yeah, hold the targeting's up. Damn it. Enemy is still alive. Back online. Okay, what have we got? 85. Bye. Come on! I won't go down without a fight. Overwatch, I am. Just don't advance, 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 don't good. Tim, please hit. Nice. Now we have to throw down a battle scanner. Next turn. That's annoying. Well, the van certainly felt that. The van certainly felt that. Target remains. It's a dangerous van, that is. Okay, that's the seeker there. Probably going for my medic. We done yet? Okay, they're leaving. Fine. Um, yep, I know you're, you're panicking. Okay, that's nice. Can I have control of the game back? Thank you. Right, now. Battle scanner. Who is the battle scanner? Did I not bring a battle scanner? I swear I brought a battle scanner. Oh well, no battle scanners today. I have no idea where the, se the squiddies are. I can move to pretty much every square. 
I have no idea where the squiddies are. Okay. Well, we're just going to have to hope they're not near Van Dorn. And I know hoping isn't the best tactic in the book, but it's what we've got. Missed the target. Should have probably got hollow attacking up first. Out of ammo here. Adjusting aim. Really? Seriously, with the like super well trained guys. We we keep missing. Finally. Probably not gonna be able to hit here. So what I'm gonna do is move here. I'm on my way. One for all. Providing cover. And we'll get cover for our rocketeer as well. wasn't going to be able to do much against that. Okay, what next? The Mel's decided to quit. And I cannot see the squiddy. You can, though. Hmm, I can see that guy as well. Okay. Oh, there's a squiddy here. Uh, oh crap. Okay. Um... Sixty-two percent chance it was worth it. Damn it! Enemy is still alive. I don't know what to do with Peter Van Dorn. He's gonna get grabbed. Might have to just allow it. Negative ammo. Out of the game. I can't get in flame for a range. And I desperately do want to be. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll call this quits, right? We're gonna get in flame for a range next turn. And I'm gonna waste these falls. I don't think we're in range at the moment. No. Just out of range. We'll move you back so that you can actually take on the Squiddy. Good to go. Peter Van Dorn will move you to the open. That way the Squiddy won't That's be blocked by line of sight. There's a chance the Squiddy will shoot you and that'll be a real pain in the ass, but... Something we have to deal with. Still out of ammo. Um... I guess we could grenade? Can we get a grenade far enough? Oh wow, no, we're never going to be able to. And you're out of ammo. You're basically useless now. Hostile targets are retreating. Not a big retreat. Right of targeting sensors didn't go off, so I'm assuming. Oh, okay, they did. I thought we got to shoot first. Okay, and we decided instead to shoot the wall. It's a very dangerous wall. Actually, with that painting on it, bloody is. If they stay together, I can flame throw them. That's fine. Come on. That's close enough. Alien contacts are withdrawing. Okay. And where's the squiddy? I have no idea where the squiddy's gone. Oh well. Time for a flame throw. If we kill them quickly, we can get meld. Yay, panic! Bad, he ran out of line of sight. Can we run a gun and shoot him with a pistol? We'll take damage, but it's worth it. Yep, panic resist successful. I know, get on with it. 
Only 74. But still a hit. Oh, yeah. Okay, now. Where is this squiddy? Headed there now. Just guess everyone's going to overwatch each other and, you know, shoot down any squiddies that come. Come on, squiddy. Show yourself. Show yourself. It's really annoying. Hello. Oh, what, where did this pod come from? They were on top of the roof. What? I'm being flanked. I thought that was it. Oh, well, I was wrong. Target disabled. Wait, they're shooting. Ah, what? They shoot. They only just got activated. How did they get to shoot turn one? That's bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. That is complete bullshit. That's t that was turn one shooting. That's not allowed. And we lost the meld. Great. Just great. Moving. Hostile fire on this position. <sighs> Got a present for you. I have heat. But still. And it's not over, because there is still a squiddy around here somewhere. God damn it! Just do your thing already, squid. Come, get killed, you know. Same old spiel. There we go, finally. God damn it. It's not acceptable. No, that was bad. Partly because there was a pod that shot us on turn one when they activated. What? They were not activated already. I didn't see them activate. I didn't. I swear they didn't activate. But also because mainly we just had a mech um, very early on that shot us. I don't think there was much we could do. I could have used the chem grenade instead of blowing it up with the alien grenade. That would have certainly debuffed its aim. And that was just a mistake on my part. I clicked the wrong button. Um, I would like rapid fire. Ah, oh, Van Dorn, excellent. Ranger, please. 99 aim. Ah, oh, that's really frustrating. At least it's only six days on that Zimbi. That's fine. I mean, you know, fatigue's four to three. The KIA, though, on Dagobert Krakellen is really painful. Dagobert Krakellen, I will miss you. You were a good engineer. But only just got you as well. Ah. Oh, it's really frustrating. Remember. Really, really frustrating. Be watching. Uh, no. I want my laser rifles. Piss off. What do we get research credit for? Aerospace. Yeah, I was right. Um, I guess we could do Cyberdisc. Because we get something for that. Nape of the Earth Small. <gasps> please, please land, please land, please land. Yes, we have a landing place. We can go and we can get some Illyrium. We can get some Alloy. We can get some Meld. Looking forward to this. Anyway, I haven't really seen Unfortunately, it's been quite a horrific day in terms of the mission. Dagger Pacquiao Allen. First mission. One kill. Died. He only just got here. He was setting up his things. He put some pictures on the wall of home. And he didn't even get a chance to get food poisoning in the canteen. Dagger Bukhalin, you'll be remembered. If you liked Dagger Bukhalin's contribution to the war effort, please remember to like. And if you're not subscribed, and you want to see more missions without Dagger Bukhalin, then subscribe. But until next time, stay shiny.